Legend Cristiano Ronaldo moved two Coca-Cola bottles at a press conference. And just because of that one single move of him moving away the bottles, Coca-Cola's share price dropped by 30,000 crore rupees. And then you had French midfielder Paul Pogba following Ronaldo and removing a beer bottle from the frame. Questions arise now on do sponsors really need to rethink their strategy after being shunned so brazenly and so publicly at international tournaments. Here's a detailed report on that. He has over 500 million followers across all social media platforms, more than the population of the US and Russia combined. If he were to sneeze, the jitters could be felt around the world. Soft drinks giant Coca-Cola discovered it the hard way. At a press conference after Portugal's victory over Hungary in Euro 2020, the winning captain gently moved the two Coca-Cola bottles aside as he sat down. And then he held a bottle of water before shouting in Portuguese, Agua. Agua means water. The subtle message from the five-time Golden Ball Award winner was loud and clear. Drink water instead of Coca-Cola. That one comment knocked off four billion dollars or around 30,000 crore rupees from Coca-Cola's market cap. The company's share dropped from 56.10 to $55.22 immediately after Ronaldo's gesture. Officially, Coca-Cola says everyone is entitled to their drinking preferences. There is more. French midfielder Paul Pogba, in a similar gesture, removed a bottle of Heineken beer. It was placed in front of him during a Euro 2020 press conference on Tuesday. While Ronaldo's gesture is being seen as promoting fitness, Pogba's act is being described as religious. Pogba is a practicing Muslim, and alcohol is not allowed in the religion. I think, I think what kind of the bigger brands need to concern themselves with is um, two things really in terms of how they activate their sponsorship. Um, is um, such things as Coca-Cola bottles or Heineken bottles in press conferences, is that outdated? Um, is there better ways of kind of activating that sponsorship? Coca-Cola and Heineken are both official sponsors of Euro 2020. After these two incidents, they must be wondering if they are getting their money's worth. Bureau Report, India Today.